What's up guys? You're watching episode number 68 of Mystery Monday! This week we're finishing off the full case of the Star Trek Next Generation Titans vinyl figures. You ready, Mix? Ready! Let's do it! All right, guys, this week we are finishing off the full case of the Make It So collection. This is who we got last week. There were eight original ones out of the ten we unboxed, and we're going to unbox ten more this week. We got one mystery figure. There's two in the set, so hopefully we get the other one as well, but we're not sure if we will or not. I think we probably won't because they're one in 40, and the case has 20. Hmm. That makes sense, Mix, <laughs> when I math it out. And don't forget, guys, you have until the end of tonight, 11.59 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, to enter our giveaway. Entertainment Earth has an extra four unopened figures from this case that one of you guys can win. So make sure at the end of this video, you click the link in the description below that takes you over to our website. You still got time to enter. You might be the winner. And of course, Thanks to Entertainment Earth for sending us this full case to review for you guys and also being extra generous for us to be able to give away four of them to you as well. If you're a fan of Star Trek and like these Titans figures, they are available at Entertainment Earth. You can go over there by visiting the link in the description below. If you've never shopped there before, you will not be disappointed. They have a mint guarantee, a low price guarantee, and a 90-day hassle-free return policy. So get on over there and check them out because even if you don't like Star Trek, they have every single fandom available at their store. Everything from little tiny figures and keychains cheap stuff to really cool expensive stuff right mix that she always likes to point out they have a category called really cool expensive stuff i like that category so get yourself something nice and bring hollywood home all right mix before we get into this tell them who's in the set there are 16 figures in the set and they're all 1 in 20 or 2 in 20 with the mystery figures being 1 in 40 and in the set there is jordy picard yar Deanna troy hugh darwin a mystery Riker, which we have, Lacutus aboard, Worf, Riker, Data, Beverly, Wesley, Medred, a mystery Picard, and Tomok. I'm really curious what the mystery Picard is. I know. I don't La know if we're going to get that one. <laughs> Last week, I sort of just threw it out there, hoping that maybe it would be Professor X. I think that would be awesome. Wrong fandom. The right fandom in my opinion. Go, Mix! Okay, we've First got... First one! Yar! Yar! Alright. She's got... Oh, a little phaser. She's, <laughs> she's the butt kicker. She is! She's like <laughs> the security, right? Security, yeah. A little overzealous sometimes. She has really nice hair. I think it's like a paint flaw, but it looks like she used to dye her roots. <laughs> and it's like nice and wavy and it kind of crosses over each other and then it cuts short in in the back there and then it's like dark brown and blonde on top and she's got like the good titan nice face sculpt and some blue eyes thin kind of stern looking lips like she's ready to just be a little bit on the stern side <laughs> and she's wearing her gold uniform with the little insignia on the chest and of course she articulates head back and forth and arms up and down and she's got the big feet which make a good base for these guys to stand on. <laughs> the Titan logo is uh, on the bottom of these guys yeah, too, Yeah, right? it's on one foot and then it says Star Trek on the oh, other. Oh yeah, Star Trek on the other side. <laughs> nice. I'm hoping to get, I got the characters I liked last week. They're still, yeah, well. I just want the mystery figure. Jordy. I don't think we're going to get them. Or do we, oh no, we, we got, got Jordy, Jordy already. Yeah, yeah who else there is War? Talking about Mix. Beverly. You better go back and watch last week's. <laughs> I got... Oh, Tomalak. Tomalak. So, let's see. Spock's he, cousin. <laughs> he's got the, like, cropped Vulcan haircut across, like, the really sharp bangs. And the rest of his hair is just all perfectly straight and, like... Bull cut. Bull cut, yeah. He's got, like, a jutting out forehead, like, above his eyebrows there. He's got, like, the really bigger nose. He's got a little bit of the laugh lines, laugh but lines, really, like really laugh lines. There's a little bit sunken <laughs> in there. He's got the big Vulcan ears, and he's wearing a checkered shirt with some colors. 
going on. He's quite, he's quite crazy, the pattern on his shirt. Can't say enough about the face sculpts. So good. From Titans. Yeah. They're very, very accurate. All right. I suspect we'll be getting a few more doubles. Yeah, your turn. So we don't have a Picard yet. We just right. have the Borg one. Oh my God, he's got, I think he's a, what does he drink? Is it a cup of tea or he's got like a coffee or something? Yeah, I'm gonna go, I honestly don't know, so I'm gonna go with maybe it's a cup of tea. Maybe it's not tea, who knows what that is. Could that be a beer? Maybe. I'm gonna say it's a brewski. <laughs> so I like it though, and it's different than a communicator or a phaser. <laughs> yeah. He's got the wrinkles on his forehead, <laughs> and he's got like the nice lip line there, and very thin lips on this guy, receding hairline, and then he's got the red shirt with the little insignia there. Those will go well together. Picard drinking a beer, and Riker playing the trombone. A little, a little break. I Get wonder stressful if that's what that is. On the Enterprise. They do have like a little bar on the Enterprise. It's my turn. Let's see Worf. Okay, I have Worf! <laughs> I am amazing. You are amazing. Oh, look oh, at that. Oh, yes. Oh, oh, I cannot remember what this is called. It's on the tip of my tongue. Uh, somebody is, like, <laughs> the first commenter is gonna yep. know what this is called. Tell us in the comments right now. Worf's weapon, what's that called? Anyways, it fits into his hand and he looks awesome. He might be oh, my favorite. That's pretty cool looking. He's got that Klingon forehead with like the little ridges coming right out. His hair is so good. It like <laughs> is so like big thick chunks going into a ponytail tied with probably like some leather strap or something and then a little ponytail hanging down like his hair is awesome. And then he's got the eyebrows that are coming up and he's got a little bit of ridges on his nose. He's got that little goatee and he's wearing the gold uniform with a little bit of paint flaws on it. He's got a sash across him on this one. So he's a little bit different with the uniform. He looks cool good. holding that weapon. Oh, he that looks, looks so really good. Cool. That's a good prop for him. Nice. Next one. I'm trying to remember what it's called. Can't. It's, it's gone. It's not in my head. <laughs> I'm going to see it and I'm going to be like, yeah, that's it. Right. Oh, we've got Wesley Crusher. Oh, he's so cute. <laughs> he's just a little boy he type. He is. He's so adorable. He's got like the cool little hair just kind of pushed back over his face and a nice, a nice boy haircut. And he's got like his little sweater with the stripes across. So like, what is it, <laughs> 80s or something? Very nice sweater. His mom probably made that for him. Yeah, probably. And he's got some gray slacks on. So. He looks very serious, doesn't he? He does. We still need uh, two more, I think. Is that right? I in the regular set. Yeah. Or, yeah? Yeah, yeah. We need um, Beverly and Gowron. Okay. And then we still need the other mystery one, which I don't think we're going to get. You never know. Never Who know. Knows, never know. Ready? You don't know. I got... Whoa! Whoa. That's Gowron. <laughs> he has all of the hair. Oh, and he's got another kind of weapon cool you won't know the name of. Klingon weapon. I know. I won't even try. I won't even try. It's called a Klingon weapon. This is so cool. Oh, I love his blade. So it's got like a hole through the middle of the blade, like a long kind of hollow part, and it's got two little small blades coming off the side. That's cool. Oh my God, his hair is so big. I can't even get into his hand. <laughs> yeah, he's still actually. It's far enough off his shoulders that he moves around. Nice. He's got like. The cool Klingon forehead, the big eyebrows that go up, his teeth are like really scary looking. He's got them showing and they are like, they look quite fierce. He's got his little like mutton chops along the side and a little beard and then he's got a kind of Klingon uniform going on and it looks like you can see his fingers poking out maybe the ends of some gloves. Just a little bit of brown on the tips of those vinyl fingers there. He looks so cool. Yeah, he looks really cool. Man, he might be my favorite. He looks like he is not to be messed with. You know, he's he also has all of the hair and it takes up like the whole figure. All right, we need Beverly. Isn't she the one you said that you cared least about getting? And she will be the last one in the regular set. <laughs> Worked out. This is a double. It's another <laughs> Picard. Ah, boo. Moving along. We got two more doubles probably. Come on, Bev. We need a full set. I got. Oh, you Deanna got another Troy. Deanna Troy. Boo. Get her mix. Maybe. We'll Get Bev. What if she's not even in there? Better be. Oh, I think this is her. I see some red hair. Oh, yeah, we got Beverly. <laughs> she looks very nice. nice. What if she got? It's probably a medical device. I can't even yeah. imagine. A probe. It looks like a probe. It could be. It could be a probe. Oh, you know what? It kind of does look like it might be like something you would look into an ear with. She has really cool mini hair. She has got like all these little waves 
and it's all like a nice kind of reddish color and her face is really quite pretty she's got like sm little eyebrows that go up there and high cheekbones a slightly pursed kind of lips there she just looks nice she's got a sweater on over her blue uniform and she still has the insignia over top of that nice. she looks very nice a little bit of a a mom sweater. She does have like a little mom sweater going on. Right, last one you guys. I don't know what this is gonna be then. How awesome would it be if it was the second mystery figure? But I'm guessing it's gonna be a double. It's gonna be a double, I think. There's no wheels with X's on them. Okay, all right. Let's see. It is. Oh, it's another Lacutus. <laughs> and all right. in the other one I'll I was- take him. As a double? Yeah, I wasn't sure if this was supposed to be attached in the last video. It clearly is not because it's detached yeah. in this one. So I didn't think it was. Don't. I didn't think it was. But whatever. I usually know all, all the things. So, but anyways, what were you saying? <laughs> so, that's the set. Nice. Well, if you had to choose, Mix, from the entire case that we unboxed, what was your favorite? Think of Wait, so what was your favorite that we unboxed this week? What was your favorite out of all of them? Does a double count as this week? Mm hmm. We never came across that before. Sure. No. Whatever. I'm going to go with this week, Lakitus Aborg. Last week, Lakitus Aborg. <laughs> okay. All around, same guy. Really? Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. For me, this week, I'm going to pick the two Klingons as my favorite. As my one favorite out of the whole set. I feel like Cyan's here with us. That's allowed, Mix, because... Let me tell you something. I make the rules. You know that better than anyone. That is true. Who makes the rules, Mix? Who? You do, you do. All right, before I get in trouble, guys, it's over to you. Who was your favorite from last week if you didn't watch last week's episode? Also, who was your favorite that we unboxed today? And who is your favorite in the entire set? And don't forget, you still have time until midnight tonight to enter a giveaway to possibly win your favorite and three other ones because the winner wins four blind box figures from this set thanks to Entertainment Earth. Yes, thanks to Entertainment Earth for sending us this full case and giving us the opportunity to give away a four pack to one of you guys. Make sure you visit them using our link in the description below. That's also how you can enter the giveaway. There's another link in the description that takes you over to our website. You know how we do it because we do giveaways all the time. But if you haven't before, don't worry about it. It's really easy. But before you go guys, just underneath the video, if you see an icon that looks a little something like this, click it. Give us a thumbs up, right Mix? Right. And what else? Subscribe. Subscribe to our channel because you got to come back here and see who won the giveaway. Plus, you want to see Mystery Monday next Monday. Plus, we do videos in between and we love hanging out with you, don't we, Mix? Yeah. As always, guys, we appreciate you watching. You guys and Star Trek and Titans and Entertainment Earth, you all. 